Mark Evans. I'm here to join the soccer club. Aww. I heard that Mr. Fuyukai is in charge of the soccer club. I want to join the club. Hmm. I'm sorry, but there's no soccer club at this school. Huh? There's no... But Apu Sleed, the person that's going to be leading this team is you. Now look at this. This is going to be your enemy, know this well. Everyone, let's play soccer! The devil himself has cast a spell with those words. It's a curse. Comrades, hear me. This thing known as soccer is a dangerous idea that is spreading all across the world today. If it continues, children all over the world will lose their very souls to soccer and will become incredibly weak human beings. It all started with this boy here. His name is Mark Evans. The historical event that triggered all this happened approximately 80 years ago at the football frontier. Now we have no choice but to alter the course of history. Coach Hillman! Yes, Bowser. All the preparations have been made. That's good. So now we can finally begin. Operation Cider Break commences immediately! What's the matter with you? 
You guys haven't practiced in a while. Come on. What's the deal? Did you get the field or not? Mm -hmm. All we have to do is negotiate with the rugby club. I knew it. Forget it, buddy. We're nothing but a joke to those guys. Since there are only seven of us, I think the tennis court would do fine. Um. Look, we'll just practice when we have the field. Mm. That's right. And that'll never happen. Mm. We're the soccer club, do you hear me? Football Frontier. Let's aim for this. We can do it. Right, Kevin, Steve? What do you say? Won't happen. What about you, Jack? Mm. Sam, Todd, you in? Mark, it isn't possible for only seven of us to participate. No, no! Shoot over there, dude. Stop distracting me! Look, guys, you joined this club because you wanted to play soccer. What's the point of joining a club if you won't play, you jokers? Ah. What's he getting so heated up about? There's no point in even trying now. Rumor has it the club's gonna get shut down. <laughs> shut, shut down! down. Hey, Mark. Hi, Sylvia. I'm sorry, I wasn't able to get the pitch for you. You tried your best. Where are the guys? In there, as usual. You want me to yell at them so they practice? No need. I'm sure they'll make it to practice soon enough. I know at the bottom of their hearts, they all love soccer very much. So I guess you're headed over to Kasenchi now. How's soccer practice working out with those elementary kids so far? Uh... It's fine. They're actually quite good, you know. You'll realize it when you see them play. Pass, pass, pass! Drop the ball! Aim! Shoot! Ugh. Not bad at all! But listen, you gotta give it your all! Kick the ball hard! Right! Nice one! This one's my signature shot! How's this? <laughs> Ugh. Who was it? Who kicked the ball at us? Uh, are you all right? Sorry about that. Um, can we have our ball? Uh, 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 oh, Mark! Uh, Is this the ball you want? Uh, 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 hey, Raymond Jr. High. Check this out, man. He plays for the weakest soccer team in existence. His team has no members, so he's kicking the ball around with kids. <laughs> <laughs> hey, why don't you show this hotshot wannabe how it's done yet, Sui? Why not? Somebody's got to teach him. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Soccer? You want to practice together sometime then? Uh, hey! Hey! It looks like those guys haven't arrived yet. Those who are on shift today, please head to the preparation room. I repeat, those who are on shift... Hey, Axel. Listen, we weren't properly introduced the last time we met, so... My name is Mark Evans. I'm the captain of the school's soccer team, and I'm the goalkeeper. You want to join us? I'm well aware that Kirkwood Junior High is famous for its soccer. That explains your kick. It was amazing! Uh, what's wrong? No thanks. I quit soccer. Why did you decide to do that, Axel? Leave me alone. Mark! Huh? Mr. Wintersee is looking for you. He wants you in the principal's office now. Principals? He says he needs to discuss something. I have a bad feeling about this. I think it could be about shutting the soccer club down for good. Shut down? I heard that rumor as well, Mark. The soccer club can't shut down. There's no way I'll let that happen. Uh, yes, sir. What is it you wanted to see me about? I know it's been a while since we did this, but we decided to host a practice match in about a week from now. Your team will battle Royal Academy. What? Royal Academy? But they're known for being the strongest soccer team around. 
they are indeed the best. They've been the champions of the football frontier tournament for the past 40 straight years. Why does the number one team in Japan want us? Please don't get me wrong, sir. I'm happy to play the strongest team, but we only have seven members on our team. If you don't have enough, why don't you recruit some more players? Huh? If you don't find enough players for your team, or if you don't win the game against Royal Academy, too bad, you're shut down. That's how it is. Why are you deciding this? Listen, this happens to be the decision of the principal as well as the president. We don't have the finances in our budget to give to a team that accomplishes nothing. What? Enough, Mark. Nellie shares the same opinion as the principal and the president. <laughs> <laughs> What did you say? You told them that we're gonna play the game, didn't you? Of course! They're not gonna shut us down. We just need to recruit a few more players, that's all. We're talking about Royal Academy. No way, we'll never win. <sighs> we'll be the laughing stock of the soccer world. <sighs> we're done. Our shutdown is inevitable. And we can kiss this shack goodbye. Enough! If you guys love soccer enough, then the impossible can become possible. You can't give up on something without even trying. We have to give ourselves a chance. Soccer club tryouts! Soccer club tryouts? Well, what's all this about? Nathan, you once said you wanted to play against the best team. You remember that? We practice over at the metal ground after school. If you ever want to play, then just come over there and meet us. Cool, think it over, all right? See you around. I recall, but I was referring to track and field. The soccer club. There's no way I would join the soccer club, but I'll tell you what, when you run out of options, come and ask me again, then maybe I'll consider it. What? Ask again? That's right. It'll be so cool to be known as the guy who saved the soccer club. Wow, you know how popular I'll be. <laughs> Why not? Hey, you! Uh. Uh. Oh, no, you found me! You want to join the soccer club? Uh. 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 Oh, that's right. I'm dressed like one of them. Are you interested in soccer? We get to play against some really amazing players! Sure thing. I'm looking forward to it. Huh? What exactly are you looking forward to? Hey! Rewind. So, we like it. thing. I'm looking forward to it. Stop. That boy that Mark Evans is talking to right now. Who is that boy? I don't recall seeing him before. It's the first time he's made an appearance. I'll check on it. It's amazing, though. Mark Evans is talented. He seems to have this unique ability to influence people around him quite easily. Don't you agree? He does. Maybe he uses magic. Huh? Axel! This place, it's awesome, isn't it? I've been a big fan of this spot ever since I was a little boy. Anyway. You must have heard about the practice match we've got coming up with Royal Academy. I've asked a number of people to join us, but nobody seems to have any interest in it. So, I mean, what's not there to like about soccer? Hey, have you given any more thought to this at all? I'd like you to join. I'm pretty sure that you and I can play some incredible soccer between us. I told you, I don't play anymore. Fine. Tell me why you helped me yesterday. Stop pestering me. <sighs> right! Let's go!
Why are you putting yourself through this? Uh, uh, Nathan! <laughs> it's pathetic. Why do this? Well, that's why. Hmm? Ah, I can't read this. Sorry, you'll have to explain this. Mm, sure. Um, it's ways to stop a ball. Uh, oh. Yeah, my grandfather wrote that book. Your grandpa? That's right. Royal Academy has speed and power beyond my imagination. And the only way I'm going to be able to stop their shots is if I completely master my grandfather's tricks. I see. So you're planning on beating Royal Academy, then? I am. <laughs> Uh, what's this? I like your spirit, Mark. I'm in. <laughs> That's great! Thanks, Nathan! <laughs> hey, guys, I'm in. What are you guys gonna do? Huh? Captain! Hi! <laughs> no way! Uh, Captain! Are you okay, Captain? You might even pass out before the match with Royal Academy, Mark. <laughs> I'll be alright, Kevin. I have a feeling these guys were here before I showed up. They've been watching you for a while now. Huh? Nathan's right. We saw you approach guys from all those other sports clubs. <clears throat> well, some. It's touched my heart, it has. All the training and hard work you're putting into this. Captain, please let me train with you. I promise you I'll do my best. Yeah, I want to be in it too. Can we practice with you, please? <laughs> of course, you're all welcome. I'm so happy you've all come through. Heads up, guys! I'd like all of you to meet Maxwell Carson. It's Maxwell, but everyone just calls me Max, though. Okay, but we still only have nine players. Actually, it's ten. Why are we playing against such a team, Jude? It's not like our skills are going to improve by playing them. We're wasting time here. We're playing them because we're following the boss's orders. He wants us to crush these guys. Dr. Kyler, the Royal Academy is here. So far, there doesn't seem to be any interference with the history at all. I'll continue watching them. Just be careful, understand? We have no idea when or how Hillman and his team will attack, so just watch your back. Understood. Cannon, I'm being serious. So, ready to begin? Let's play some soccer, okay? Yeah, we're ready. <clears throat> what the? <gasps> This is the nation's best club! This is the Royal Academy! This is the true nature of Royal Academy Soccer! Oh, poor Mark! Raymond Jr. High can't even attack back! Is this match over already? Captain! No, oh, no! <laughs> sorry. I'm sorry. I couldn't stop the ball. Forget it. There's no way you could have. It was just too strong. There's no way we could keep up with that power! What are you talking about? We just got started here. Let's keep doing our best. That's a whistle for the half. Raymond Junior High is having a very hard time. It's 10 nil at the end of the first half. This is bad. I don't even think these guys can talk. What is it about Royal Academy? None of these guys seem to be tired or out of breath. It's obvious, right? 
They haven't been running around like us. I feel as if this was all set up so we would look like losers. No! I'm not gonna let it end like this. We're gonna make them run hard in the second half, okay? But how, Captain? I'm so tired. I don't think I can run anymore myself. Yeah, I feel the same way, Captain. What's the matter with you? We've only finished the first half of the game. The second half of the match is beyond our abilities now, Captain. I'm with Jack on this. Maybe we should just give up the game. <sighs> Enough of this! You guys are talking as if you've been defeated already! But it's not over until it's over, you got that? Get up! Let's try winning! What a pathetic bunch of kids. Why would anyone be motivated to fight when there's no possibility of winning? That's because he doesn't believe that there's no chance of winning. What did you find out? Sir, you're right! That mysterious boy you saw earlier is indeed not from that time period. There seems to be a strange dimension surrounding him. Is that so? Continue to keep a very close watch on that boy, Palsen. At the same time, continue to identify the turning point in history and do what's necessary. Do you mean... The danger faced by Axel Blaze will have a strong impact on Mark Evans. If he fails to participate in the game, then... Well, this is an important time, and it cannot be ignored under any circumstances whatsoever. We're about to begin the second half! How is Raymond Jr. High gonna fight an undefeatable team? What are their plans? Royal Academy kicks off! <sighs> Alright. The Death Zone. Let's do it. Lure them out. Sharp take the shot! Death, Death Zone! zone. Keep it going. We're gonna make them weaker than ever. <laughs> come out now. Come out now. If you don't come out, I'll take down the final player. Okay, I'll crush him. Oh, those guys. They have no intention of scoring another goal. They just want to torture him until the end. What is this? How dare they? This is not right. It's not soccer. Nathan, no. Nathan, no. Nathan. Nathan. Hey. Mark, you must. I know what you're saying. I'll do my best. I swear, I'll do what I can to protect this goal. <laughs> well, you haven't done a good job of that so far. Take this! Fireball! Screw! You won't score! I won't let that happen! Raymond Jr. High is turned to kick off! But no one seems to be standing except Glass! No! I don't want this at all! That's it! Raymond player number 10 has left! William Glass has forfeited! The Raymond 11 has now become the Raymond 10! How pathetic. 19 nil. You should all be ashamed of yourselves. You couldn't even score a single goal. <laughs> Not even one goal. There's no way they're catching up to them now. I guess that proves that they were never a good team. It's not over. Uh. It's not over yet. It's not over yet! Julia really loved soccer. She was making her way over to cheer for me. When she got into an accident. So I've decided not to play soccer until she wakes up. But now, 
their persistence is shaking me up. Let me play just this one time. Please forgive me. Julia, what's the matter? Oh no, you've gone ahead of me now. Brother, you can't play. Brother, did you forget? It was soccer that did this to me and that's why I hate soccer. It hurt me and you're still gonna go and play? Tell me you won't play. Who are you, girl? <sighs> Your sister, Julia. How can you say that? You're not Julia. Julia was always supportive of me when it came to soccer. <gasps> Julia doesn't hate soccer! She was always proud of me! event indeed wait a minute you're not a part of this it's no problem let the boy play fine he can play since royal academy is no objection so he plays for raymond junior high axel you finally decided to <laughs> you're a bit late but still <laughs> oh here we go <laughs> axel blaze has switched with Billy <laughs> Kraft. We have a new number 10! Now we actually have a reason to play this game. Oh, I see. Now I understand your aim. <laughs> oh! Let's go. Time for Death Zone. Death, Death Zone! zone! <laughs> All right, bring back the blade! How come Blaze is running forward? Why isn't he defending Evans? He's running towards his opponent's goal! What? Is he trying to run away from the enemy like Glass? I know. He's running because he believes in me. I will stop this ball. He knows after I do, he's gonna get the ball passed to him. Evans has stopped the Royal Academy shot! Ah, it's all you, Axel! He passes the ball to Blaze! Fire! Tornado! Ha! That's the legendary fire tornado! Oh, wow! No. Raymond Junior High has scored his first goal ever thanks to Axel Blaze! <laughs> Alright! That's the game! We've just received a notice of forfeit by Royal Academy! The game is therefore now over! What? We have failed. Axel Blaze has already fallen under the evil spell of Mark Evans. This is going to cause problems. We detected no movement from that boy, sir. Hmm. Go for the next move. So, the next is Olga. No. That's our final weapon. We should stick with situations that exist in this period of time as much as possible. Yes, sir. The next thing they do is participate in the Football Frontier Tournament. How would you like to proceed? One can never know what an accident is going to happen. For example... An incident with Axel Blaze's little sister, Julia. Okay, guys. The Football Frontier District Preliminary Game is coming up real soon. So we've got to practice as hard as we can. What does that go? Hush 
走るコース変えて砂浜を裸足で走ろうぜさあ出かけようみんなで海へ悲しみなら忘れ物してよし濡れた海パン流れた涙乾かす夏の太陽やお一体全体どうしたってんだ暗い顔してらしくねえな体にこもって頑張るなって一人で何でも頑張るなって悩んでも時間の無駄下を向いたって始まらねえいつもみたいに強気なお前答えはそうさすごくシンプルつながってんだ心がまっすぐなうそひとつない言葉がこの胸に刺さり手を仕掛け抜けてゆく稲妻お互い相手を思い合うそれが真の宇宙聞こえたぜ元気になるよ Oh, you've come back again. Yes, I'm back. My answer won't change no matter how much you ask. I know that, so I challenge you. You're challenging me? That's right. I heard from the detective that you were once a goalkeeper. Great. The price of flowers gone up again. <clears throat> hey. Oh. As a keeper, your job is to stop every incoming ball. I heard about what happened. So, what if you can't play in matches anymore? That means nothing. Your life isn't over. It's just starting. <sighs> Look, quit yapping, you brat. Let's compete. You want to compete? Yeah. Show me what it means to be a keeper. Um. All I'm asking you for is three shots. If I can stop three shots, you have to be our coach. You're quite confident, kid. Right. Shoot. He's got some power. You were one of the Inazuma 11. That's shot one. Two more. Not bad. <laughs> Don't get cocky, kid. If you let the next one in, we drop this talk about coaching altogether. Sure. Right. Show me what you got.
<laughs> the district competition finals. We're competing with the Royal Academy again. This time we'll show them. Isn't that right, everyone? Yeah! I'm so happy for you, Mark. We've got a much better coach in Mr. Seymour than we'd had in Mr. Wintersea. Seymour's name is... I'm sorry. It's Mr. Hillman. Hmm. I only have one request for you. I ask that you give it all so you have no regrets. Yes! Yes, Jude, what's wrong? It's the district matches final. I ask that you allow the team to fight honorably with the improved Raymond Junior High. Raymond Junior High are already winning the game. They're what? What do you mean? I mean a brilliant commander can secure a victory even before the battle has begun. Excuse me. Football Frontier, District Final Face-Off! Raymond Junior High versus Royal Academy Star Zoo! Suddenly, metal bars have come out of nowhere and have fallen onto the pitch! What a strange occurrence, and all in a soccer match, nonetheless! This can't be. Not after coming this far. <sighs> this is bad! Raymond Junior High's side is full of holes! What about all the players, though? They're safe! All the players are okay! None of the players seem to be wounded by the bars! This is truly a miracle! So that's what he meant. Jude told us not to move even when the game starts. But where did all this come from? We failed again. So these are the levels that Ray Dark is capable of. It's hard to believe that even Ray Dark's power was not able to get that kid Mark Evans out of our way. This just goes to show that we simply can't afford to underestimate the boy. Royal Academy, or will it be Raymond Junior High? So, the first team to attack is Raymond! Kevin! All right! Dragon Tornado! Ha! Take my power shield! You're not gonna get past me! Nice! Sharp takes the ball up the past wall side! Sharp and Evans, one on one! Evans! Will this be a goal? Yeah! Oh wow, it's Blade! Blade came back from the front line to stop Sharp from shooting! Yeah. Hold on to Sharp and Sharp! Dude! <laughs> I swear upon this leg, I'm gonna win. Emperor Penguin! Two! What's going on? A powerful, never before seen shot is making its way towards Raymond's goal! Let's end this right now! What a move! He stopped 
the ball with his face! Bobby! Bobby Shearer! A sacrifice play! Herman Welch with the corner kick! If taken, but too sharp! Then he passes! The backboard! And back to sharp! The, the twin, twin boost! boost. Yeah! It's another new move to challenge Mark Evans! <laughs> It's amazing! Evans is punching the ball down! Ah! You couldn't even see his arms clearly! Dragon! Crash! It's useless against the power shield, you'll see! Ah! The power shield's wall is good for absorbing energy, but its weakness is that it's thin. There's always a chance that things might get bounced back, but if you shoot from close range... Then what? It can be broken! Dragon! Tornado! Oh. Goal! We might have tied the game! That's it! <laughs> oh. <laughs> Emperor Penguin! Two! I'll stop this for sure! God hand! Godhead technique is holding it back! Let's see, will it be able to stop the ball this time? Hang in there! Evans is being pushed back! If it can't hold it, the ball is gonna go into the goal again! No, I can't let them score! I can't! I can't! I will not! Ah! Oh wow! It's the Godhead technique with two hands! Way, Way to, to go! go. Alright, oh, right. Mark! Let's keep it moving! Mark worked hard to protect that goal! Yeah. This ball will... Uh, uh. Ah. <laughs> this ball will make it in! This is inability teamwork! Full power shield, you won't score! What? What? Ah! What the? What's this? Mark Evans has come up from behind Jack Wall's line! Yeah! Uh, it is the one! Drop! Go! We scored! We scored! We scored! He did it! The goalkeeper Mark Evans himself came forward for the shot and scored it all for a game! <laughs> yeah! There goes the final whistle! Raymond has won the game! Royal Academy's 40-year reign as champions has finally been broken! The national competition is next. Yeah, and I promise we'll play hard for you guys, too. Oh? I take it you have no idea, then. Huh? Well, Royal Academy will be playing in the competition as well, you know. You see, the winning team from last year's tournament has automatic entry into this year's competition. What? My goal was to remain undefeated, but now my goal has changed, Mark. From this point onwards, the Royal Academy has a new purpose. Okay, what's that? We aim to avenge our humiliation at the hands of Raymond Junior High. I see. So we get to play Royal Academy one more time, right? Mm. <laughs>
Battle of Shuriken Junior High, National Battle One. <laughs> Royal Academy, they've won the first round. Yeah, they didn't win. They lost 10 nil to Zeus Junior High. It was a landslide win. They couldn't do anything at all. Even my brother had to sit out because of his injury. By the time he came on, all the other players were down and out. They simply didn't have the energy to go on. You seem a bit frustrated, Jude! Yes, I am! It's Zeus Junior High, I want to defeat them! Then defeat them! We can't! Real Academy's been kicked out of the football frontier already. So you're just gonna stand here and accept that, are you? There is a way to do this, Jude. Because you've only seen Mark when he's facing you as your enemy, am I right? This time, why don't you fight by his side? Mark to your high has the lead! An important goal has been scored! Oh. <laughs> That's impossible. This can't be how we lose this tournament. Hey, come on! What's the matter, guys? Why are y'all so down? Please don't tell me you've given up just because they scored a goal. The game isn't over yet, all right? Bobby, Todd, Tim, Nathan! We need a special technique here, if we're gonna fight them back. We have a special technique! <laughs> and I don't mean the fire rooster or the Inazuma drop either. None of those moves make any difference. Our special technique is our undying spirit. It's our will to never give up without a fight. <laughs> Undying spirit. That's right. And that's exactly how we were when we fought Royal Academy. Same goes for Wild Junior High, Occult Junior High, and Brainwashing Junior High. Otaku Junior High was the same, and so was Shuruken Junior High. It was the same with all those guys. We just never gave up. I'm not going to give up. If we give up, that'll be the end of it. And that's not how this team plays soccer! That's not how we play soccer. Uh-huh. Yeah! Yeah, Captain! 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 This is what it means to fight alongside Mark Evans. This is the true strength of his team. This is our soccer. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, Inazuma, break! It's been a while, huh? It's me, Eric. Eric Eagle. The field magician Eric Eagle has rushed back from the U.S. Frame on to your high and powered up once again. Is this a brand new technique? <laughs> Try Pegasus. Fire, Thomas. I. Yeah, 
Who? He's a very dangerous boy. Mark Evans' spell has taken over Raymond Jr. High. We must take them down immediately. Pause it. Operation Cider Break, second stage. Initiate Operation Ogre. Sup? Coach Hillman, what about the mysterious boy you were so concerned about earlier? What do you want to do about him? Forget him for now. He hasn't done anything yet, so he poses no threat. Members of Olga! Are you ready? Yes, sir. Very well, then. Your mission is to alter the history of the Olga Academy. Understood. Olga is ready. Gentlemen, we're going to use the sport of soccer to change the entire course of history. We do this for the future's sake. We're going to create an entirely new truth for our history. This can't be. How could gods not win this? <laughs> it's because we're demons. And we eat people like you. Operation Ogre. Phase one is complete. Ogre. They're stronger than I expected. I can't just sit around. It's amazing. I always knew that Ogre had incredible battle skills, but even in soccer now... This is not soccer to those boys. They're all soldiers that have received special training. That makes them a very special team. Mark! What's wrong, Nathan? It's Zeus. They were beaten 36-0 in their last match. 36-0? No way. They've got some incredible skills as a team. How could they lose the match by so much? Who did they play? Ogre Academy. Ogre Academy? Were they there at the opening ceremony? Ogre Academy? It's finally arrived, everyone! The football yeah. right here for Ogre Academy and Raymond Junior High will battle for the crown of number one in Japan! Ogre Academy crushed Zeus Junior High in their last game. 36 goals! So Raymond Jr. High is getting a lot of attention. This is gonna be a very interesting final match! All right, guys, we can win this match. We're going for gold here! <clears throat> Victory will be ours! Yeah! yeah. Uh, it's here. What's that? Mark Evans, yes? Right. My name is Batapu Sleed. It's great to meet you. Good luck. How naive. Huh? Who befriends their enemies on the battlefield? Huh? Battlefield? Ready for attack. Spread out! Come on. Let's get into position as well. Yeah. Now the time has come. After this game is over, Mark Evans will choose to completely disregard the sport of soccer himself. This match will teach him just how ridiculous soccer can be. And we'll finally be rid of the idea altogether. Members of Volker, 
Prepare for battle! Yes, sir. Start phase two. <gasps> Whatever. Go! Yeah. Raymond moves up aggressively. Heads up! What the? What is it? Wow! Ogre doesn't seem to be moving! This is a strange defense! None of the Raymond players are being covered! They've already reached the goal! Well, I'm very happy to keep on moving! Kevin! All you! <laughs> Thank you! Swift has intercepted Sanyu's path! Yeah? Why? They played so differently last time. Do they want to play? The ball was stolen from them, but they make no attempt to retrieve it. Forget about these guys! Just keep playing your game! Right! Hey, Axel! Go! Got it! Go! Good. It's another interception! Not again! That was the perfect chance to score a goal! Is it just me? Don't you find this all a bit strange? Raymond has possession again! I don't get this. What's wrong with these guys? Something isn't right about this! Yeah, I don't understand why they're not even trying to score a goal. Not good. The players are getting frustrated. And Ogre doesn't seem to want to attack. That's the first half! It's still nil-nil! Raybon had possession of the ball mostly, but have yet to score a goal. Didn't I say this is gonna be an interesting match? They're not doing anything except taking the ball from us. Yeah, it's weird. I have to admit, I'm getting quite frustrated and annoyed with their attitude. It's making me real angry. We had so many chances to shoot, but you never took your shots. Yeah, he's right. Why didn't you guys take any of your shots? We couldn't shoot. What? It didn't seem that way. Uh? Were you afraid that you'd miss? Is that why you didn't take the chance? <sighs> I don't know. But I don't feel good, though. He's right. We couldn't go in deep. It's the truth. Mark, that's why. Yeah. That means we have to do anything and everything to make this work. Even if that means breaking a few rules, Max? We have to change the flow of the game. <laughs> I don't know. I have a bad feeling about this. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't like this kind of soccer. Come on, Jack. <laughs> Please, guys, hang in there. I understand how you all feel. It certainly didn't feel like soccer to me during the first half either. I can't explain why this happened. But are we going to continue to play the way we feel in the next half? You're right. You've made a valid point, Mark. So what do we do? <clears throat> they seem to be quite shaken. They're beginning to worry about their abilities to play soccer. It is a very effective tactic. Well done, pal, Zen. Ready to move on to the next phase. Uh, Dr. Kylard, are you ready to... I need more time. Just keep waiting, all right? <laughs> it's the second half of the game! Neither team has scored. Let's hope this is more exciting than the first half. Oh, 
Let us take that shot. Yeah. Right. Again. Right. Right. Phase three. Start. So now they're attacking hard. Yeah, now they're finally showing us their true character. Now it looks like it's begun. Are you all right, Steve? Sorry about this, guys. All right, change up. Jim, Sam, you two, Tim. Sir, yeah. let's do this. Yeah. New players coming in. Raymond Junior High has made a few substitutions. Stop them! Run. Yeah. Death Spear! This time! Majima! No. Look at his face. I have no doubts that Mark Evans' heart will be shaken considerably as he witnesses his players continuing to fall hard. Gradually, his spirit will be smashed, and he won't have the will to play anymore. Raymond's in a bad situation. This isn't good. They already have injured six players. How are they going to continue to play? <laughs> Still continue to spread, or of no use at all, as Over Academy seems to have total control. <laughs> No! Mark Evans. Huh? Just give up soccer. Uh. Look, you actually call this soccer? Your passion is hurting your teammates. You really want to hurt them some more? Give up soccer? This is bad. Evans is going to be crushed. <laughs> Dr. Kylard, Raymond! Sorry to have kept you waiting, Cannon. I have everything you requested right here. Thank you once again for your patience. Uh -huh. Thank you, Doctor! <laughs> it's time I protected everyone's future. Here we go! Enough of this, Ogre. If you want to play soccer, then aim here for the goal. Just stop injuring my players. Either give up soccer or choice two. You will die! Yes! I'm 
<laughs> uh, uh. So he showed up too now. What's the plan? No change. We continue with our mission. Who are you? My greetings, great grandpa. Huh? What? I'm who? Uh, I know this must be a shock. Who is that guy? Great grandfather? Something like this has never before been seen in the history of the football frontier! There are 10 minutes left, and these 10 minutes are gonna be fantastic! My name is Cannon Evans. I've come back in time to fight for you guys in the soccer game. It's my duty as your great grandson, right, great grandpa? My great grandson? I. You'll understand if I'm in shock here. He says he's from the future and we're supposed to believe him? <laughs> here. Huh? Oh, no way! It's Grandpa's notebook! It's real! It even has my memo! What you've written here is very true. It does have power. Uh, what? Mm -hmm. You can read my writing? Hmm. All right then. Mark, I think this kid's the real deal. Uh, I believe him too. How about you? I say we try. Yeah, why not? I've been watching you guys play for quite a while now, Great Grandpa. I'm really sorry to have come at such a critical moment in the game. Critical moment? Why? Because this game is very important. Team Ogre! You're trying to change the course of history here, but I won't let you! What difference do you think you alone can make? Who said I'm alone? That's right, I'm not. I brought some of the strongest players I know with me today. Hey guys, come on out! Uh, uh. Like the wind, I'm Sean Frost, Alpine Junior High. How are you doing? Sorry for the delay. I represent Inazuma, Japan. I'm Austin Hobbs. I'm one as well. Archer Hawkins. Previously from Genesis Academy, <laughs> Xavier Foster. I'm representing Italy's team, Orpheus. Today he'll be on you. What's going on here? It's great to meet you, Captain. We know all about you. No need to introduce yourself. Huh? These are people you'll meet in the future sometime, Great Grandpa. They're all very powerful players, and they all love soccer very much. So they come out here to help you play Ogre Academy. It's all thanks to you, Captain, that I'm able to be here. That's why I want to help you. Captain, Axel, I'm looking forward to this. Coach Hillman and Mark, we're ready to play. Captain Evans, we're happy we have the chance to help out. Mark, it's an honor to do this. <laughs> Uh, what the? Mark, why are you crying? What? I don't know. They came out here because they all love soccer. I'm so touched that they've traveled through time for this. <laughs> Thank you, guys. In the future, you're given credit as the person who spread the word about the joy of soccer, Great Grandpa. You're held in pretty high regard, you know. Believe me. Mm. Mm. I did that? Yeah, and that's exactly why we've come to protect the present. I believe you. Every word. Now then, let's give them our best. Let's win this game! Mm. Uh -huh. <laughs> we're ready. Let's show Ogre what we're made of. Right then. It's time for us to get back in this game, people. Yeah. Take every single one of them down. Understood. Mark Evans. It doesn't matter who you bring into the game. You'll lose this battle. This isn't a battle, all right? It's soccer! Well, coach? Hmm, fine. Switch the players around, then. <laughs> it's the Football Frontier Tournament Final! With only ten minutes left, there have been a few interesting developments. Raymond has changed six of their players, and it remains to be seen how these new players will affect the outcome. Will they be able to catch up? Will they be able to win this game? Great Grandpa, let's play some soccer, okay? Yeah! Hey, Sweet, we'll never give up soccer. Because it's thanks to the sport, 
I have all these friends. Move! Come on! It's not that easy now. Yeah! This awesome guy's got some skills! Hey, thank you! Check this move out! Tell me what you think! Takes these losers out. Look. You're very well aware of the reason you're down there, aren't you? Yes, sir. Let you have all the fun now. Nathan! Let's go! Yeah! yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I can't believe. 
believe I had to use that technique. Help! No way! It hurts to see your shot stop like that. Hey, brush it off, guys! You can try again! No giving up! Get it! Get up! Let's finish this! What a pathetic bunch of humans you are. Final attack! to lose. We'll win at all costs! Mark Evans, give up Sakura for good! Give it up! I'm never gonna give up soccer. As long as I have friends who love soccer as much as I, I'm never gonna give up soccer, you hear me? My great grandfather just rocks! That's the final whistle! The score's 3 2! I'm on to your high whistle! Yeah! Yeah! yeah. 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 
It's all over. We failed in our mission. Patapu! That was an amazing final match, wasn't it? <coughs> I'm glad we got the chance to play you. Thank you. I was thinking, maybe we should play again soon. We're not gonna allow you to cast your spell on us! After the game's over, we're all friends, right? <coughs> It's precisely this thought pattern that has made all humans in the future weaklings! They've completely forgotten how to fight for anything! That's why we came here. We need to change the future! <laughs> What's important is making the present time strong and worthwhile to us. Fighting's not important. But having the courage to fight when necessary is. And as long as you have the courage, you can change your future. Yeah. Courage also allows you to become stronger with your friends. Wouldn't you agree that courage is what's most important? Mm. Courage. <laughs> <laughs> Friendship. Maybe you're right. This courage you talk about, maybe we've been lacking in it. But still, Mark Evans, the future the future that we are to live in. You'll find it. Uh-huh. All you have to do is have courage. You'll find it. Sean, Xavier, mm. Archer, mm. Austin, mm. Fideo. Mm. And Mark, I speak for us all when I say we look forward to playing soccer with you again soon. Mm. Mm. Sure. It's time to go, Great Grandpa. It was awesome playing with you, and I'm glad that this happened. Me too. Well, bye. You take care, Great Grandpa. I will, Cannon. You too. Yeah. Uh. Uh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> A new champion to yeah. the today! Yeah. Raymond Junior High wins the Football yeah. Frontier Tournament, making it the number one soccer team yeah. in all of Japan! The number one team <laughs> in Japan! Kama,
追い繋がって立ち上がれたのは仲間たちのおかげさ僕たちはいつだって青春のど真ん中だぜそう辛くて涙こぼれそうな時も隣で支えてくれるグッとくる関係に感謝そうさ最初から昨日はうやつばかりじゃないしちょっとしたことで仲間はレッドかしだけど同じ時間共に過ごし同じ夢見て今じゃ気の合う仲間さ共に強くなった怖いものなんかない負ける気しないんだよ僕らのチームワーク史上最上級さうまく話せないけど言わなくてもわかるよ今の僕ら